I just met up with these guys to go to age day. Look what she got. This C40s. Right. <laughs> and Miguel, we'll talk about that later. What's going on, guys? So today is the first day of age day. I'm with uh, Ali, who has a supercharged FG2 and the 8 gen. She got a CT blower. Or is it Jackson Racing? I know she has one of the two. And yeah, she is with Miguel, who has the FD, the gray FD2, but with the turbo 500 horsepower. But he, uh, he kind of blew it up. like those seats she got like i'll show you guys when we get to the show VIP man, we doing the thing, and they got some cars lined up down there. But yeah, today should be a good day. I see some cars over there. I see a lot of uh, drag cars. So the black type part that was behind us, this guy actually watches the channel too, so that's pretty dope. I believe he won the H Day giveaway. I said the first person that was to see me uh, won a giveaway. I believe he was the first person last year, so that's pretty dope to see. I ran into him. Some dope cars, um, something green, different. Uh, Got some dope cars. You know. That's what she said, right? I won. But yeah, I see, I see that FD2 down there. That drone is looking me. I know y'all can't see it, but it's slammed to the ground. It looks, it looks me. What's going on, guys? So we just made it to H Day. Got a dope FG2 right in front of me. I believe that one's Craftwork Supercharged which is dope. Got some people still coming in, type R. Ali's over there. That's some nice cars. I saw this is the one I was talking about, seeing this FD2 over here. Wide body, bag, looks dope. Um, it's later on in the day. I decided to wait till everyone reach here to start filming, but they have some dope cars here today at day one for H day. I know definitely tomorrow, day two for 2019 is gonna be packed. But I'm gonna show you guys some of the cars that we have here. It's all this like, red and purple theme. Alright. So in about let's say in about two minutes, in about two minutes we're gonna get started with the low composition. Got the Vicaros, purple harness, curls. Alright, so I'm gonna need this area right here. Okay. Make sure 
real nice. Clean. Look what we got here. Got a CRV. The cars, the cars have to go right through here. We don't want to hit that. So, give me guys a little sub back there. Oh. Got another FA5 right here. Real nice. Got an intake. Some brand lights. Got some bride seats. Looks very clean. I like the carbon fiber dash and everything. Looks real nice. Got an NRG steering wheel right there in the Neo Chrome. Looks dope. Got some bride back there. Red headliner. It's real nice. Got a sub back here with a kicker. In the middles we have like a bunch of Type R's. There's a lot of uh, white, blues, and black Type R's. You guys can see black, blue. You guys can see blue, white, blue, 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 white, black, white, black. Bunch of type bars here. We got this night gen right here. Real nice. Cosmos. Racing wheels. Real nice. I like a little black chrome to it. SIC Takata harness. Nice. Carbon fiber steering wheel with the suede. Real nice. Got a little cage back here. Real nice. Carbon fiber fenders hood. Real nice. That looks dope. Very clean. Got an Acuras TSX. Man. So we'll for back Stop here. another race track. Jacob to the set. Taking a move. Pulls the shoot. 930 with a 915. Real nice. Got this like camera. Repairs Jacobs. Repairs in the left. Repairs Jacobs has come to play. 930 with a 965 on the mile an hour mark. Justin Duke and Eric Fernandez coming next. Justin Duke is left, and Eric Fernandez is not. Justin Duke in the S2K. Six speed. This thing's got it on the floor. Is wailing it the hard Very way. It's on the racetrack. He's not going 950. He's going 1095 with a zero. 141 there for Justin Duke. Issues for Eric Fernandez. Looks like he's going to get pushed back. Love the Avans in yellow. Very clean. It's very good. This wrap is crazy. Some crazy flakes in it. Crazy flakes. But I really dig this right purple wrap. Crazy wing. Right now, top leaderboard. That's crazy. Now that's a crazy wing. And his bag. Cosmos racing wheels. The pearls are crazy. I don't know if you guys can see this on the camera, but. Pearls are crazy. And we got a night gem nope. over here on some gram lights. Five and Sanchez is going to finish off and the game. And has CT supercharger on there. Not sure if he has an issue here or what, but it didn't quite look right. Real nice. And it's on bags. Yeah, Nalta is not going to get done there. Why is he going to get on a dance? You just saw if he didn't have a fun one. Nice Looks dope. Nelson Olivia. I gotta show you this Type R. This gotta be my favorite Type R here. It's this one right here. This front lip on the Type R looks really aggressive. I don't know if you guys can see that. It has like two little holes in the front. Like right here in carbon fiber. Looks real dope. Definitely like this look. It kind of makes the car look a little bit lower to the ground compared to the regular stock front look for the Type R. It looks dope. It's real nice. Clean. But he got a lot of like little carbon fiber touches. He has this lip right here that 
makes the car look more aggressive and lower to the ground. You got the Mishimoto intake. Looks nice, got a little carbon fiber bits here and there on data. And you can see what he makes stock horsepower, new horsepower. He has the sequence manufactured titanium downpipe as well. Nice. So he made like a little over above 300 horsepower as you guys can see. Yeah. But I really like the carbon fiber vents right here. Goes around the side, looks dope. Carbon fiber on the side, as you guys can see right there, it's dope. Carbon fiber in the back. Real nice. So all of this is carbon fiber. It's real dope. And then he has like this mirror right here so you can see the exhaust. It's real nice. Uh, has a nice little bit of touches for carbon fiber. Looks real nice. And the wing carbon fiber. You guys can see. It looks dope. I like the wheels as well. Looks real nice. Some more type bars. And this is one of the subscribers that watches the video. It's this Type R. I like this view on my wheels. Real nice. Looks dope. Real clean. Pretty dope. Ready exhaust. Real exhaust. Two, two pipes. You guys like this little extension. Kind of like a duck bill in the back right here. Dope, different, different. Type R seats. I love the Type R seats, man. And they're comfortable. If you ever get a chance to sit in some Type R seats, definitely do it. They feel really comfortable. We got a bunch of different uh, intakes. Inventory intake. It's nice. Yeah, they up Got some rays. Both racing. These look nice. Yeah, we're gonna get the rotator out, run it off real quick. We're going back on a few more. We got the Ramus exhaust. The exhaust really sounds good on the type R. It's like a little button where you press and you can choose to open up the exhaust more, medium, or close the flap to make it quiet. Pretty dope exhaust. Ooh, these wheels look beautiful. I wanted this. Yeah, I'll let you demo it Oh man, this car right here is sick. This paint is clean right here. Got a little banners, there's no limits. This thing is super clean. Got a Mugen valve cover. Real nice. Very clean. Got a little canard right there. Ram lights. We got Will Woods front and back. We got sliding into rotors. We got some bride seats. NRG carbon fiber steering wheel. Real nice. Stay tuned, shifter. Real nice. Got this crazy wing in the rear, battle arrow. And with this car, the Del Souls, you can put the roof in the back. It's pretty dope. Yeah. Very clean. I love this color. Oh, we got this beautiful spoon EP3. It looks dope. I believe I saw him last year at H Day as well. The car looks beautiful, immaculate. It's really good. Ooh. RPF ones, yellow tire letters, yellow valve cover. Real nice, it's dope. Got some Recaros. This 
crazy how the EP3's got the shifter right in the middle like that. <laughs> so. That's a beautiful red RSX. I like these costumes racing. I like this color in it. It's like a bronze color. It looks dope. Comment below guys, do you guys like these taillights? The little octagon uh, FD2 conversion taillights. Got a wide body on here, like fender flares. Hmm, this is different. It's different. Definitely on bags. Got this S2000 right here, spoon front end, real nice. I don't know what color this is, it's kind of like a Nardo gray, but it kind of look a little brownish, it's dope. It's crazy, when you look at the S2000 motor and the way it is, it's like from the side, the headers go out like that, intake comes in like that, the oil filter is right there, and then the ground is like right there, so easy to take the oil filter off and everything. Pretty dope. This thing is super clean, guys. Real clean. Look at this engine bay. This gotta be the cleanest engine bay right here at the show, in my opinion, that I've seen so far. Got the K-Tune uh, manifold. It's real nice. Got the, like, copper and gold. The copper and, uh, polished look going on looks real nice real nice I like this polish and copper thing going on with all the dresser bolts shifter cables k2 shifter cables real nice vibrant Woo. 60 millimeter throttle body Real nice, very clean. This looks dope. Very clean. Got some Macaros. Real nice. Pro's harness. Got a little sub back here, roll cage. Very clean. Look at this, man. This thing is clean, guys. Woo! Got the RR carbon fiber hood, OEM HFP front lip, got the Advance, RGD 2s with the spoon caliper sliding drill rotors, got the Mugen side skirts, Mugen visors, OEM, aired out, sucking tire, Mugen rear lip, Mugen wing, OEM, all OEM, clean. Real clean, guys. And here is Ali's car that I cruise with down here. She got the Z40s, grays. I love that color. It looks real nice. She got the tire letters on there. The car looks really good rolling with the tire letters. She got a like a pearl white wrap on there. See, she got these status bucket seats. She had the blue one, and then she recently got this purple one. It looks real dope and it kind of goes with the theme as you guys can see in the mirror you guys can probably see like it has like the little galaxy of the purple and the blue up there it looks dope it looks real nice and as you can see it is right there on the dash as well real nice and if you, of course you guys know it has the jackson racing supercharger on there after cooler got an ice box it looks real nice. 
She got like these carbon fiber pieces in the front. It's real though. Unique and different. She got the spoon sport steering wheel. Got some gauges in there. Supercharger. I know recently new with the car, she got the ZE40s. And I also know that she had they got the rear seat delete, which looks dope. It's kind of like a little panel they put that back there, but it looks like carbon fiber. It looks dope. Real nice. And we got this night gen right here. Two door. It's real nice. Carbon fiber hood. Carbon fiber hood looks really aggressive. With the vents. Real yeah, like this panda theme going on. Got the red bride seats in there. It's dope. What's going on, guys? So today is day two of age day. Right now, age day is packed up. There's a lot of cars here. People are playing music, and it's really loud. But man, they have some dope cars that came out today. So I'm gonna share with you guys some of the dope cars. Guys, I just ran into another subscriber. It's dope being able to see all you guys here but the car is looking super clean man i'm falling in love with the rgd2s they look freaking amazing in the sun man. But this car man this car is one sick car right here you got the four giatas this thing is crazy the interior is ridiculous I'm gonna be giving away. There's gonna be crazy. Yeah, giving away. Okay. Right? Got this big TV in the back. We got a tank up here as well. Looks dope. We got a little fire extinguisher in the corner. We got his two compressors right there. Crazy. On a beautiful weather day. Well, got the F in the, for the Ford Auto logo. This thing is dope. Got this cord right here. AG wheels. I love the engine bay. Real nice. This is pretty dope. I never noticed that. It tells you like the voltage of the battery. Right there. I don't know if you guys can see that. But right there tells you like the voltage of the battery. That's pretty dope. Of course. Dang, look at that. That is crazy. Real nice. <laughs> It's got the tank set up, two compressors. Nice. Real dope. This Type R is one of the new colors that came out. Again, competition it's like in this gray. It looks real nice. It's like a gray. It's got a little metallic flakes in there. It's nice. This color looks dope. This new color that they brought out on a Type R. Looks real nice. I really like the seats. Uh, this is a nice color. So we got another agent right here on bags. I like the speaker right here, iPhone speaker. And the vent tank is just financial mistake. That's funny. Well, this thing is slammed to the ground. It's dope. Got a nice gym. Nice wrap. Got the teal color. It's dope. So guys, I came over here by the fastest night gym at H Day right now. And it's tuned by Vit Viper. Vit Viper does a lot of the Motec stuff now. He tuned my car a while back. And as you guys can see, this car is a Motec. I think he said he ran a 9. 55 or 957 which is fast but the kit that he has on there is the parallel turbo kit with the skunk 2 manifold nice setup nice i don't know guys like i've been telling you guys i'm looking at going turbo so i've been looking at a lot of crazy uh setups so i'm over here by the drag strip side looking at the kind of turbo setups how the lines are run i'm looking at different stuff like that but this car this car is making some crazy power and it's moving Woo. 
dope. Yo, guys, this SC thousand. This got to be the best SC thousand at the show. Spoon hood, spoon front bumper. OEM hardtop. Car seats. Real nice. I like the seats with power bucket seats. Look dope. Clean NSX. Supercharged NSX. Ball ball with having troubles making consistent passes yesterday. Ball against the line first, but West Drive driving away for the win. Right seats. He runs the 817 with a 0. Right hand drive. 84 miles. In his bag. Looks like a little grab on FD2 front end. <laughs> guys so i finally made it home from h day and i gotta say today was an amazing day definitely i was surprised that i a lot of you guys the subscribers had noticed me at the meet it was like 10 to 15 maybe 20 people it was crazy i didn't even get to film a lot of stuff for h day day two but there's a lot of people that uh, noticed me and recognized me and showed me so much love and support and i gotta say thank you guys i really appreciate the love and support so on the way home that night gen SI uh, pulled up next to me, <laughs> asked me if my car was boosted and I told him no. And I don't know why he thought my car was boosted, but then, and then he wanted to do a pull. So then you guys saw the end results. Then I told him since he wanted to raise a boosted car, I was like, go raise Alley. And I know you guys saw the end results of that. So that was pretty crazy to see. But man, today was a fun, epic day. Age Day was definitely, it was real nice this year. I was surprised, but definitely I know that Age Day Fall 2019 is gonna be crazy. A lot of you guys said, hit me up and said that you guys are gonna come out to fall. So I cannot wait to see you guys in fall. Age Day is gonna be incredible. So I can't wait to see you guys. That's it for the video, guys. I wanna thank you guys for showing so much love and support i appreciate it also guys if you guys like this video definitely hit the like button and if you're new to the channel subscribe to the channel and if you guys can share the video it really helps out the channel a lot and definitely as i've been telling you guys i really want to boost the car either supercharged or turbo but the goal is at least over 400 horsepower so sharing the video definitely helps the likes helps and subscribing to the channel really helps so thank you guys for everything oh, i'm just getting tired Thank you guys for everything. I really appreciate anything that you guys can do really helps because it will definitely speed up the process on boosting the car because I'm really getting down to 
my last step with my last steps with the car that I really want to do. So thank you guys. But that's it for the video, guys. If there's anything that you guys want to achieve, find your inner drive, the thing that drives you to take a step toward your goals every single day and make it happen. Peace. Oh